My name is Sophia, and I've been locked up in this miserable psych ward because they think I'm crazy. I can assure you that I'm not. Before all this, I had led quite a comfortable life. My life took a turn when my parents thought it would be a great idea to enroll me into a university since I'm much healthier to them. Little did they know, it was the university that actually broke me. Hey, so. Hey, Aren't you excited? About what? Come on, girl. This is our first day of uni. How is it that you are not excited? I don't know. You're not nervous, are you? No, I'm not. Really? Maybe I am. Well, maybe... It, but you'll be fine. Because you're going to be with me. Yeah, I suppose. That's my girl. This is Adam. We've been friends for as long as I can remember. He always knows how to make me feel better. When I found out that he would be going to the same university, I'm so glad and relieved. Wait! What? I think this is it. You sure? Yeah. Well, go on then. You do it! Fine. <laughs> but you open the door, okay? And you are interrupting. Oh, sorry. Just get in. Um, introduce yourself first. Then you may take a seat. Uh, hello, my name is Sophia. I'm from Subang. Not just to me. To the class. My name is Sophia. And I'm from Subang. I'm an ambassador of the professional communication program. And I... Uh, is that it? Hmm, all right, enough. Go ahead and take a seat. Now, class, back to the lesson. All right, as Carrie mentioned, chapter five. All right, now let's move on. Uh, chapter five, we are doing meetings. I thought you'd have to introduce yourself. That's so unfair. Of course, the girl with the anxiety should have to be targeted by the lecture on her first day. No less. Don't be mad. Maybe he didn't notice me. Don't be silly, I'm still mad. And me? What did I do? Not you. And him? Yes, well, I don't know. Just that. I know. Well, I know it was hard for you, but he didn't know me. And as far as he concerns, you're just another student who came late to his class. You were late as I was. Yeah, but I'm charming. Alright, so far, clear? Yes. Alright, let's move on to the next one. Types of meeting. Now, everyone got me in Um, excuse me, can I have this chair? What? The chair. Can I have it? Um, cause I like this with my friend over there, but we don't have enough chairs, so I was wondering if I could take this one. If you'd like, you could come and sit with us. Oh, um, no thanks. I'm seating my friend here. Okay, I'm so sorry. I didn't know you were waiting for someone, so... Guess I better leave then. You're totally welcome to join us, you know. So, what 
happened? Why are you there? I didn't, I was in the cafeteria and then suddenly you disappeared. I was looking all over for you. You left me. Uh, okay, I'm sorry, but I didn't. I was just getting my drink and then I looked over for you and you were gone. So I went to look for you. You did? Yeah, and you were with that girl and you seemed preoccupied, so I thought I'd leave you alone. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I didn't tell you. So you want to get back to cafe? Um, I'm Amelia. Yeah, you're Sophia, right? Yeah. We're in the same class together. I was wondering if you would like to join my group for the assignment. I don't have enough members in my group and we need at least four. Unless, of course, someone else had already asked you that. Uh, no, no one has asked. Oh, okay, good. So, would you be in our group then? Uh, but can, I, can Adam join as well? Yeah, sure. Um, but wait, who's Adam? My friend. Oh, okay. Uh, is he in our class? Yeah, same as me. Uh, best year of Rocky. Yeah, class! Uh, just a sec. Um, okay, I gotta go, but my friends and I are meeting tomorrow at the cafeteria during lunch. Uh, do you think you and... what's his name Adam. again? Yeah, Adam, do you think you and Adam can make it tomorrow? Yeah, I guess so. Alright, All right. see ya. Bye! Bye. comforts me, making those trains. Ever since university started, I've been depending on it more and more lately. The comfort. In that moment, the reason suddenly hit me as to why Adam kept disappearing on me. He's tired of me. I mean, he must be. I have been in his life as much as he has been in mine. He must have gotten tired of me. He must have wanted new friends. Hey, so. You, you dished me again. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. This is the library game. Look outside. Why? So you could disappear on me again? So, you are making a scene. What? Am I embarrassing you? Is that it? That's why you don't want to be my friend anymore, right? So, let's talk outside, please. Hi. Why you keep on ditching me? Look, so... You know what? Whatever your reason for disappearing on me, I'm not buying it. But... But I... What Adam? Did I do something that makes you mad? Are you mad at me? Is that it? Yeah. Do you not want to be my friend anymore? Are you tired of me? What, am I holding you back? No. That's course. it, right? Of course not. How could you even think of that? Can you believe me? I'm leaving me behind. What am I supposed to think? Stop. You know that's not true. Yeah, sure. Sophia? Adam, I'm tired, okay? Half the time I'm badly the anxiety when, whenever you disappear. And half the time I'm worried about losing you. You're not going to lose me, so. Say that. I I'm sorry, so. I. I know we've been. Deserved to you lately, but I thought I was helping you. Helping how? I don't know. Well, you were making friends, so I thought I don't want to hold it back. What? That's dumb. <laughs> I, I just assumed that maybe without me, you'd be more inclined to make new friends. 
or let's distract it. Distract it? Helping it. I know, I know it's stupid, but... Enough, I know. So? It's stupid, but you're my friend, so I've tried to understand. But just this one. So... We call that. Ha! No. But you can make it up. Anything. Tomorrow you come with me to the meeting. Meeting? But... Either you come with me to the meeting, or... I wonder what to do. So, wait. What? Do I need to do this? Yes. So, uh, I don't think I can do this. Don't be stupid, Adam. And then I honestly want to know what's going on with you lately. And you're driving me insane. Even if you can't do this for me, at least do this for your grade. Look, Adam, it's not like you have any other people, right? No, but... So, let's just go already. Suji up the other day. Oh, this is Adam right here. Oh, is he a ghost? Nice. Amelia, you didn't tell me everyone is such a riot. Oh, it's funny. Like, you have to legitimately realize that this is a funny situation. She knows a ghost. He's like, no, 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 scary joke. Okay. Oh my god, how is it really funny? Is that like, how Sophia? Yeah. There's. There's no one there. What? Where's Adam? <laughs> where, where, where's Adam? I need him, please. please. I just I don't know. I just, I just bring him right now. I need him. So, why? I don't need you. I need Adam. Adam's not real. Shut up. Oh, okay, I need. Please bring me Adam right now. Sophia, Adam's not real. He is real, he's my friend! So, I think shut up! And that is how I ended up here. They think I'm crazy. They said Adam is not real. They insisted that he is only a figment of my imagination. But I know he's real. He's my friend. Despite his behavior lately, he is still my friend. After the whole incident, my life got worse and Adam had disappeared. I now not only have no life, I too do not have any friends. I'm glad you're back. You're not back? No. Why? I'm tired, Adam. Tired? I'm fighting. Fighting for you. But you don't have to. But I do. I have to fight for people trying to convince me that you're not real. Fighting the drugs you show in my system, hoping I stop believing in you. Fighting the reality that you might actually be just a figment of my imagination. Fighting to believe that I am indeed out of my freaking mind. I wanted to die, Adam. If there is such a reality in which you are not part of my life, I wanted to die. So yeah, I'm not mad at you. I'm glad you're back. Now I know I'm not crazy. Please don't believe me again. I would never.